In a shocking turn of events, Davide San Clemente, the winner of Love Island, was caught distributing what has been described as illegal hippie crack at an after-party in Manchester. Our exclusive video shows Davide using an air canister to prepare balloons filled with nitrous oxide, also known as laughing gas, for his friends. This revelation comes after a whistleblower at the gathering revealed the true nature of the gas being used. Nitrous oxide is classified as a Class C drug and was reclassified in November. Serious users now face up to two years in prison, while dealers can be sentenced to up to 14 years. The dangers of nitrous oxide cannot be ignored. Taking too much of this gas can lead to loss of consciousness and suffocation due to lack of oxygen. It is a serious matter that should not be taken lightly. It is worth noting that there is no suggestion that Davide himself indulged in the gas he was distributing. However, his actions are still cause for concern. This incident comes amidst Davide's party-filled lifestyle in Dubai and the UK following a split from Ekansu Kokyalogu earlier this year. Over the Easter weekend, Davide was out with his friends and was filmed filling the balloons in the early hours of Saturday morning after attending the Solaris of the Sun event at Firefly Club. In a video shared with The Sun, Davide can be seen using a blue pump to inflate the balloons. However, his spokesperson declined to comment on the matter. This is not the first time Davide has been involved in controversial behavior. Last summer, he was seen sniffing a white powder during an Ibiza bender, which led to the temporary split of the TV dating show couple. At the time, Davide's representative claimed he was snorting snuff. Following their reunion, Ekansu and Davide finally ended their relationship for good in January. In March, Ekansu entered the celebrity Big Brother house, and Davide expressed his frustration in a late-night video, where he raised a shot and exclaimed, F asterisk asterisk K Ekansu. A source close to Davide revealed that he has been going through a tough period recently and has not been feeling like himself. Despite this, he has been trying to put on a brave face, socialize more, and focus on his fitness to improve his mental health. It is important to address the seriousness of the situation and encourage Davide to seek help if needed. Substance abuse can have severe consequences, and it is crucial to prioritize one's well-being above all else.